Okay, welcome to another uh, episode of Culinary Experiments with Jailhouse Burritos. Uh, this week's is going to be a Jailhouse Burrito Corn Dog. For this, you're going to need your burrito. Um, don't let it sit in a towel and firm up. Just make it like you normally would. Roll it up and put it off to the side for now. Uh, this one is made out of uh, cheese puffs, Doritos, and Slim Jims. Then you will need a hot dog and a popsicle stick. You're going to want to wet the popsicle stick up. Um, well, for mine specifically because I'm baking it. You could deep fry this and it might firm up a little bit better than baking it. I'm not really sure. I've never really done this before. So, yeah. So what I'm going to do is take the popsicle stick and put it in one end of the hot dog. Like I said, I will be baking this, and I've preheated the oven to 375. There we go with that. Now basically what you're going to do is just take this out of its packaging. You can see that it is firm, or uh, formed, I mean, sorry. Um, and you can definitely tell it's, uh, well, by holding it, that it's uh, it hasn't sat and firmed up yet. It's just kind of a soggy mess. And then just kind of, I have no idea how this is going to work. Like I said, I've never done this. Push the hot dog in the middle of it and try to encase the entire thing Okay, it turns out that this is actually very difficult to do because the jailhouse burrito, um, I'm sure you can imagine, is very sticky and <clears throat> kind of wants to stick more to your hands than the actual hot dog, but it takes a bit of doing and you can get it. I'm actually almost there. Basically, I think the idea is to replace the, I think it's like pancake, isn't that right? I'm, I don't know, I'm not sure. What's usually um, like a pancake type of substance on a corn dog, but just replace it with a uh, burrito <clears throat> or tamale, a lot of you users like to call them. and then bake it to try to get some of the wetness out of the burrito have it firm back up and just turn it into a corn dog basically god this is difficult this is difficult I tell you alright well I think that's pretty good now like I said I've never done this before um, so bake times temperatures I have no idea if you try making one of these just uh, play around with it and find out what works best for you but uh, I'm doing 375 for probably I don't know 10 to 15 minutes I'll just keep an eye on it and see how it turns out okay I'm gonna go ahead and say that this attempt at this did not work. Uh, that's not to say that it won't work. You'd have to play around with it a little bit. I mean, the idea is kind of cool. It just didn't hold together, um, as you can see. But if you were to if you were to deep fry this, uh, the chips would harden up pretty quickly. Um, I left it in for, I don't know, maybe nine minutes or so, and then I could just see that it wasn't working, so, but, hey, it was worth a shot. Well, thanks for watching, um, be sure to check back next week for uh, another episode of Culinary Experiments with Jailhouse Burritos. Uh, like, comment, share, uh, especially comment if you have, you know, an idea of uh, something that I could make or try making.
And be sure to check out uh, my Facebook, my fan Facebook page. I will include the link for that in the description. Thanks, and have a good one.